Welcome back, everybody. Afternoon, evening, and morning. For me, it's going to be evening. Today, what I'm going to be doing is, well, I just got out my disability, so I went and picked up the last thing I need to do on, well, not the last thing on my list of, for my golf cart, but to get my sound system done. Here's my box. So that's what I made up with some leftover wood that I have. Yes, You're, that's right. But I'm not using this one. I already got one pre-done because I took two of the same size. So this is going to be run from my stereo down to my battery and so on, you know. You got three wires in there. Perfect. We can, we can wire all three wires up. And then when we get down to the end, you yeah, know, we just run those two together. And then that to ground. And then we just turn it on and off the stereo. But... The only thing is this, you gotta make sure you turn off the stereo. Take the faceplate so then there's no bat juice going to it. Or maybe I might do a quick disconnect. Who knows on the end of this. Now this is what's going to go into my box here. I even got this that I'm going to cinch down inside so it doesn't move. So that's just a little tip for anybody that wants to do a wire, any wiring. You know, you already got a housing on here, like a protective housing. I don't know if you can read the specs on that. But it's uh, 18 AWG X. 3C, 105 Celsius. I don't know, I figured it would be a pretty good wire to use. I already got my hole pre-drilled for the wire. But also, I haven't decided if I want to add rear speakers. So then on the back of the end of the golf cart, you can have rear speakers. So there's a couple, two things. Well, there's, uh, yeah, two parts that I had. I was going to use one one of them because I had both of them. And there were r little round things that you plug in the wires into. So I was going to drill a hole in here, a nice round thing in there. But then I was just like, no, nah, I don't want to do that. It's just too, too much. It's going to be a big little opening and then a thing there. So it's just going to look ridiculous. And then I was going through some stuff in my room, like some boxes to find some things for the stereo build or whatever I need. And I came across these kind of style where you can mount up speakers. So I was thinking maybe we can do it just like that. Something like on the sides. I do apologize. But something like that on the side. Instead of having something kind of like one inch round hole up in here. I think that'll be a lot better. So I'm going to go with that. But when I decide to add rear speakers, that's when I'll put them in. But for now, I'm not going to even bother. I did pick up a deck today. Which, you know, I wish my CD players had the MP3 plug-in. So I picked up this today from Pawn Shop. MP3 plug-in. Came wood. Here, I'll show you what it looks like. It's up in here. That's going to look pretty sweet. So. 
So I bought that. I bought these from Princess Auto. Five watt, five inch marine, two way, 80 watt speakers. So I'm gonna be soldering this all up today. I know I should be probably cleaning those wires up, but I'm going to go with it. Because then I can melt these wires. I don't like, I don't like using uh, wire cutters or whatever that do these. I prefer using a lighter because then you 100% you get what you're getting. Now with just what you don't need, you just like cut it off. You got a perfect end. No fray, no nothing. Just make sure you keep enough on there. I wish I had some shrink tube right about now. I got electrical tape and it's in my tool bag inside. Alright, I'm back. This is what I was saying for the side. May I have that on the side? And that's in. Yeah, that could be okay. That's better. I couldn't find my electrical tape anywhere. So I'm soldering them lengthwise like so, going across like that. 
not like not like this. I do apologize, it takes me a bit here. I should be having a little plate under here, a metal one. I'm not doing this over the table. This is what this is for. This is from a hard drive. Well, we're going to already know that's going to be automatically ground. Then these two wires go together. So this will be red, the white's red, green, yellow. I think I'm going to use this stuff to cover the speakers and this is just uh, your garden uh, prevent weeds. <laughs> 